Dear viewers, in this brief video, I'm going to explain how you can get uh, returns on mutual funds from the Econ uh, interface. The returns in Econ on mutual funds are supplied by Lipper, Lipper Analytic. That's the name of the database. And so in order to do that, uh, we need to go to Build Formula. I'm going to illustrate this for one particular fund and so if you want to do it for multiple funds then you have to find a solution for that yourself and so i'm selecting a typical fund and let's just take this one um, put it in So put it in. I have it now here. This is the Lipper code of this uh, Frontier fund I just selected. And then the second point is we need to find the data item. And the data item in this case comes from the Lipper database. So you need to go to Lipper funds here. And to find a time series of monthly returns, you have to go to essentially this variable, which is called rolling performance. You add that to your query. So now it's here at the bottom. Uh, but before inserting it in the spreadsheet, you first need to um, do some tricks here. So first of all, uh, you can get this information for the past six months, the past year, the past three years, the past 10 years, or since inception, whatever you want. I choose the past 10 years monthly returns interval frequency well that's monthly you know i don't think you really have to fill it in but that's what you do you could choose to make the currency into euros if you're doing this from a european perspective and you have benchmarks in euros it makes sense to have this in euros as well and i think that's it then we can of course change here the formatting of all of this so you can watch here. So now we get the returns essentially in the columns. But you know, I could get it in a row if I wanted to. So I leave it just for what it is now. I'm okay with this. I insert it. And here is the information. So this is essentially what we asked for uh, using the rolling returns for this fund with this Lipper code uh, for the past 10 years uh, monthly uh, returns. And so the last return is that of uh, 31st of March 2021. And so there was a return of 2.508%. So here it is. And here you see the disastrous month of the COVID crisis, the minus 24. Well, put yourself, you can uh, do this as you want. Of course, you need to pick up a list of Eisen codes if you want to do it for an entire universe. But this video uh, hopefully helped you a bit further in your quest for returns on mutual funds.